over your fears, nobody's fucking opinion named Johnny Pants 49 who says you're ugly should stop you from fucking <laughs> winning your life. It's funny, VaynerMedia is super interesting to me. I'm building VaynerMedia the way I was raised and the way, which is, I think, I really believe in this. I think you over coddle and over love up front. You just establish it. It's just love and you're good and you're like, almost like, like delirium, like blind, like you're the best. And then, around six, seven, eight, you start chipping away at it, like, and start saying like, no, you're not the best basketball player, like, you're not like, and start creating some realistic part. But when you establish, like, a foundation of you are, and, and, and what my mom did was, she overspent her time conversating about what I was great at, she made me have consequences for what I didn't, and away we went. Hello, how are you? So. What up, vlog, good morning, Houston, Texas. <clears throat> H-Town motherfuckers. Uh, got a speech here. Gary Vaynerchuk! I came here today to inspire you to go spend 50 hours learning through reading books, watching videos, downloading PDFs. I don't know how you learn. I came here today to inspire all of you to spend 50 more hours, whether you know this, like Steve, but he should know more, because if I needed to know more, he knows, needs to know more. Or you completely dismiss this because you're fucking stubborn and you think you can beat a tight, this is a fucking tidal wave. Do you know what happens when you try to stand up to a tidal wave? I'm finding a surfboard and riding it to the sunset. You think you're tough and you're gonna get fucking annihilated. Please go put in the 50 hours of work of learning. Please download every fucking one of these apps. Start tasting them and learning it. Get over your fears. Nobody's fucking opinion named Johnny Pants 49 who says you're ugly should stop you from fucking <laughs> winning your life. A bunch of business calls and then off to uh, Super Bowl. Uh, tonight we have uh, our, our party which is the Entrepreneur Magazine and Vayner Sports Party of the top entrepreneurial athletes. For a lot of people here, you've willed this into success. Like a lot more than you'd ever really imagine. Like hard work is an unbelievable variable. You know, I get, I'm getting shit on quite a bit right now and I've been very careful in clarifying over the last 24 months, depending on how long you've been following me, of like, no, no, I sleep six, seven hours, I'm more focused on the other 18, because it's true, like I sleep, it's just that I'm on fire because I'm happy. I'm from fucking Belarus, baby. What up, Target? What up, Target? So going into uh, the party here uh, in Minnesota, Vayner Sports Party with Entrepreneur Magazine. Uh, I'm really, really excited about it. it should be really great. Uh, very focused on the best entrepreneurial athletes, giving away some awards, doing a fireside chat. Looking forward to it. Good man. You excited about your first Super Bowl party? Yeah, this is uh, this is like super interesting, right? Like passion, uh, have fallen in love with the industry. I mean, when I when I see the entrepreneur logo and you know, it's one of those things when you grow up from humble beginnings and you have passions. If you would have shown me this picture, us two. Those two logos, you know, I would have been like, what? Yeah. You know, and so uh, it's super, uh, it's yeah. super uh, humbling. Respect where the attention is. So you're gonna tell me how you, as entrepreneurs, are gonna elevate the vibration of the collective of your community. For me, uh, I've penetrated youth culture because I understand Snapchat and Instagram and YouTube and all those things way better than any person in this room. And, in the world. and, and what I've done is I've gotten in very early and I'm pushing very tried and true, work ethic, kindness, gratitude, Abundance. patience, and watching 15, you know, getting DMs from kids who are like, yo, just six months ago, I'm just laying in my bed, doing drugs all day, listening to this, that, and the other thing, and you've 
you got into my stream, you got me looking at different shit, and this is where my life's at. The way I'm looking to elevate is I'm looking to get in real early, and I'm trying to, through sheer force, build popularity so that kindness and gratitude and empathy become cool things instead of putting cash to your fucking ear or having ice on your fucking wrist. Yo, what up? Uh, Batman asked me to close it out. <laughs> this is my favorite meme. <laughs> Vayner Sports Party went well. We're going to Tao. Um, we can't show that. And so, um, we'll wrap it up. Big day tomorrow. Reading the audio. I, don't, I came to this Super Bowl weekend to read my fucking audio book so I can get it out <laughs> sooner for you fuckers. So, I got you. I got you. And special guest in the back, Patrick. Show him. Show him. There he is. I don't know if there's any fucking light. Who's got light? Show this man. Oh, he's got him. Got him. Uh, 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 the T. Let's go, baby. K Swiss for life, baby. K Swiss for life.